And in another gospel, it says that Jesus knew in his heart what they were talking about, and Jesus asked them the question. But in this gospel, they propose the question to Jesus and say, who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? And Jesus does something so different than he normally does. So different. He grabs a child and pulls a child into the conversation because Jesus normally talks in parables. He normally tells the story and talks in parables and has that be a part of his reality because the stories people can find their places in. They can find where they fit and which character they relate to, and they can say, you know what? This is where I find myself. But instead, he's in the house, and he grabs a child, and he begins with this wonderful conversation. And just imagine being this child in Jesus' arms, and he goes, whoever wants to be the greatest, become like this child. And this child's going, whoa, he's talking about me, <laughs> right? And all the disciples are watching. Whoever humbles himself is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. Whoever welcomes one such child welcomes me. And he's talking about this child, and it's so different because he grips this child and brings this child forward. And I started thinking about what does childlike faith mean? Because it says you have to change and become like a child in your faith. What does that mean? 